Hello, welcome. Take a moment, try the problem out on your own, and then press play when you're ready to solve it with me. All right, so we've got a problem about tides, and they rise and fall. It says, on a typical day, we want to predict the time to the next high tide. The most important value would have to be what? Well, before we look at the choices, we're just saying that you've got a periodic um, function that's modeling the tide. Right, it's going up and down. So let's say this is the high tide. This is the low tide. Well, if I want to know when the next high tide is going to be, if I know it's periodic, that means it's repeating every so often, right? There's going to be, there's going to be some time value. If I know how long it takes to get from one high to the other, that will always happen. That's a definition of a periodic, right? It's going to repeat itself that same length, right? Determined by next high tide. So, for example, if that was uh, 10 hours, that means every 10 hours I'll go right back to high tide. Now, I don't really know much about high or low tides, although this has got me curious. I'm wondering what are some reasonable intervals for it, but if, the, if it was 10, if that's not possible, I apologize, then that would tell you, okay, if this is 10, the next high tide will be 20 hours from where we are now, and so on and so forth. And that's why the time between consecutive low tides is equally important. If you knew this low tide to this low tide, that distance, it gives you the same value because, um, and I, I focus so much on high tide, um, they want to predict the next high tide. If you knew when the, how far apart the low tides are, you know halfway between them is the high tides. Same reasoning. Um, so again, if I knew one high tide, the low tide was at five, next to at 15, and, and it's a periodic function, the high tide is exactly halfway between, it'll be at 10 hours. Then, you know, you can go from there. Although I would say consecutive high tides would be even more useful. All right, thanks.